It's time for another Cool Tools review. This time we're taking a look at the DLI IoT Relay. The three to five volts that comes out of an Arduino or a Raspberry Pi can be useful for lighting up an LED or spinning a toy motor, but on its own, you can't control an appliance, right? You can't just plug your toaster into an Arduino. That's a limitation that loses some people. The DIY solution is to wire together a relay switch that uses a low voltage trigger to switch mains electrical voltage on and off. But with this comes some real risk of fire and electrical shock. Splicing 110 volt AC electrical wires scares me and it should scare you too. This relay power strip from DLI is a great alternative to electrocution. You have two outlets that are normally off but get switched on when triggered and one outlet that's normally on but switches off when triggered. On the side here, you have a removable screw terminal block that takes your low voltage trigger from an Arduino or Raspberry Pi, anything three to five volts. One connects to ground and the other connects to an IO pin. Finally, the best part is that there's an outlet here that's always on so that you can power your board. So you get power for your board and your project all in one package. When working with mains electrical voltage relays becomes this safe and easy, you really have freedom to play. I made a little project that uses an ultrasonic sensor and an Arduino to send out five volts to the relay when my hand gets close. And now I can literally control any appliance with a wave of my hand, a light, a turntable, a fan. It's great for interactive props or holiday lights or data logging projects or IOT projects, gardening systems, you name it. I learned about this through Adafruit. They sell this same one and they're pretty picky about what they carry. And remember, you can see thousands of reader recommended tools like this at cool-tools.org.